everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Mill from Millamore Nursery. I have brought on Sweet Clara. Now Clara is a full body silicone. She is my Russian silicone. She is 19 inches long and um, I remember part of her um, sculptor's name which is Dimitri something. <laughs> um, she is a drink and wet uh, silicone baby girl. And she is the last of my drink and wets in my nursery. And um, I thought I would do something a little different because I'm filming in advance. So literally I've just finished filming uh, one with Mackenzie coming out of the cradle. I'm not sure if I'm gonna upload that one or not. I filmed uh, a change of baby she Easton, a change of baby Angelica, which already went up on Sunday, which is today. Um, I will be gone away um, for at least a week from my channel. And so I'm trying to uh, at least put in, you know, a few extra videos while I'm away. So I thought in between the tasks that I was doing and my other channel where I am doing my One Book July and trying to get things organized and sorted for tomorrow, I like to keep busy and not think about things too much. When I start to think about things too much, my anxiety rises um, and I can't explain it. It just does because there's that perfectionist in me that, that you know... Um, instead of being spontaneous and, you know, free like I used to be at one point in my life, you know, um, now I, you know, start thinking about, well, what if, what if, what if, what if, which is a crazy way of thinking. Um, but I only share that with you so that, you know, if you're like that as well, that you, you can, you know, relate. Um, so if I post this on Tuesday, it will be the first time I've had a little silicone on for Tiny Reborn Tuesday. And Tiny Reborn Tuesday, as I explained in some of my other videos, is a um, theme that I came up with some time ago. There weren't many themes at the time. Not that it matters, folks, because honestly, you can do whatever you want, like Dee from the Baby Patch says, on any day that you want. You do not have to need or want a theme to do any of your dolls or your reborn dolls or your teddy bears or anything that you want to post as long as you're having fun as long as you're having fun and um but i wanted to bring on clara because i changed her sister mackenzie and she was still in this onesie that i twinned the girls out some time ago um so i'm going to remove her pacifier she does take a full pacifier in there look at how like that's a huge pacifier my goodness and this is what she looks like now she's got beautiful korean gray gloss eyes in that um wonderful little face of hers and she like i said is russian she came from a russian artist um yeah she's just very special She's very special because she was my first full body silicone that had the drink and wet in her that, um, that I still have, literally. So, um, she is one of two. Mackenzie is the other. She's got these big full lips and a wide open mouth and a drink and wet system. So she decided to take down this blanket, which is just a vintage, um, receiving blanket uh, lately, that's been her thing, is to have a receiving blanket as well as Boo Bunny, which matches her outfit, actually. Um, the little pink nose matches her headband. And I'm just trying to get it so you guys can see her face a little better. Hopefully, I can angle the camera so you guys can get the light. Um, and like I said, because I've been doing videos back to back, I don't know like what what kind of conversation will erupt from this one. But I know in the video that I did of Baby She East, and there was uh, quite a um, quite an interesting question I posed on that channel. 
So I'm going to start by taking this little girl down out of her uh, little onesie because that is all she is wearing. And I'm going to put her in the same sort of thing that Mackenzie was put into, which is a vintage dress. And uh, instead of a diaper cover, she is going to, or instead of, yeah, like Mackenzie had like a, um, like bloomers on top of her diaper. I'm just going to put like on top of Clara's diaper. I'm going to just put a diaper cover and I'm not sure that it's vintage at all. It is Kowal Baby. So it looks like that. It's got unicorns and frogs on it and princesses. And it's Velcro. Now, I'm not overly fond of the Velcro because Velcro over time tends to kind of give way. But this is the dress here. It is vintage. It is... It says six to nine months. Um... But isn't that cute? So I thought that that would kind of go together. And literally, it's just mainly so that she has a little dress like her sister. And Mackenzie is now back in the cradle that the girls share. So the girls will both be in vintage dresses and vintage bottoms, regardless of the fact that she's not going to be wearing like... Um, the exact same bottoms as her sister or the exact same dress. I can't twin these girls. They're not at all twins. They're just my silicone girls. Um, so I hope everybody's doing okay. I want to thank you for clicking on today. And uh, if you've done a, um, a video on your reborn and called it Tiny Reborn Tuesday, I want to thank you as well. Um, I really appreciate that. I truly do. Um, I do watch or I have been watching most of my, um, whether I comment or not, I watch it on the television. And, and I don't know if you guys know this, but it, you can't really comment. You got to go back on your phone and do it. My phone overheats now and it needs to be upgraded and I'm stubborn. No, I just don't want to put out the money. Now, I do feel that this diaper is getting just a, hmm. Yeah, I think it should be okay. Should be okay for the next little bit. I'll make a note that says you need a new diaper next time. Because this is going to be pretty much a fast little change with little Clara. Isn't it, darling? Yeah. Um, little fast change. I love how the sleeves have the elastic in it. And I do not like this tag, however but it's soft. It's gotten soft over the years. I would say this, this dress is probably from the seventies because you see the stretchy arms like that. So I've learned how to dress them by just maneuvering the clothes and not the little one itself. And we're going to flip her over. Now she's got a much thicker neck and a, a much different um, build than Mackenzie because of her drink and wet, because she's got a tube down her throat, she doesn't have the flexibility in that throat. So I just generally turn her on her side as such and do up the buttons because I don't want to be twisting her neck. So Clara used to have a sister in the community. Um, I think Lynn had her, Cora, um, and then Cora has now been adopted out. Um, same artist, but the, the dolls themselves, they look similar, but of course they weren't. Every doll, every doll is different. Um, and I was never really sent any official paperwork with this doll, although I was told there were seven of them. So I'm not even sure what number this little girl was, but I was told there were seven. She is seven pounds, 19 and a half inches long. Yes, you are. And you suit that little dress. You do. But she showed up to me, I swear to you. She showed up to me wearing nothing um, but a diaper wrapped in this beautiful... You've seen the blanket on the walk with Nova Lee. That blanket, it, it was like a tablecloth kind of blanket. That's what Clara was wrapped up in. And she was being flung around in the box. And I was quite surprised. Um, 
And I kind of reached out to her artist too because I was concerned. I was concerned that she had been damaged in shipping. I scoured her body looking for any damage. None was there. Uh, the artist herself apologized for that. But you know what? There was no harm, no foul, right? I just simply advised, you know, I suggested that, you know, not to put a reborn or a silicone doll in such a large box because, you know, that's what happens. Now, like the other diapers or diaper covers I've shown, this one here, you slip in like the extra little bits so that it would line, you know, it would line the area so that a real baby would, you know, be able to use it. We're not going to do that for Clara because, of course, she's got a diaper on. And these strings are absolutely everywhere. Oh my goodness. So I am a week older <laughs> if I post this on a Tuesday. And, you know, I, people always find that interesting that I say that because, yeah, I'm a week older. I could literally celebrate, you know, my birthday in 52 intervals of the year. And why not, right? Life is short. Um, and so I celebrate it today. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> I am another week older. So I am not sure... <laughs> how well this Velcro is going to stick, but it will do just fine for her. And it actually looks really cute, really cute under that dress. And I'm gonna just maneuver her a little wee bit so you all can see her a little bit better. Let's see which pillow works best. Sometimes the camera angles aren't the greatest. But there's the little diaper cover and you can tell like this is the sizing snaps here. And what I'm going to do is put the same hair bow back on her hair because look, it actually matches. She's got bows here on her dress. Let me just lift her close. So she's got bows there on the collar of her dress with the pink and the green, which is a lovely combination. I love that. So Miss Clara can have this back in her hair. And I'm actually not going to even do anything with her hair. Her hair is perfectly fine. I'm going to give her back her soother. She loves her soother. She's gone through like a variety of soothers, but so far this one just seems to suit her best. And I'm going to give her her little bunny. You see her? I'll turn her to her side so you guys can see her. There she is. Little chunky, chubby thighs. And, you know, folks, like I said, Tiny Reborn Tuesday doesn't have to be about preemie dolls. It doesn't have to be, because I have Daphne. Daphne is nine inches. She's the mini Becca sculpt. And um, I was gifted her by Tammy over at Tater Tots Nursery, and I haven't brought her out either. Um, but you know what, like any one of your dolls, apart from the toddlers and, you know, I always miss the toddler Tuesdays, which Sam and Renee, I apologize for. I don't always miss, but <clears throat> because I host Tiny Reborn Tuesday, you know, it's, it's just something I do. So there's Miss Clara with her bunny and now we'll get her blankie. So she can go back up and spend some time with her sister, Mackenzie. This is a faster video, folks, and I wish that each and every one of you are having a fantastic Tuesday. I'm pretty sure this is going to be going up on a Tuesday. And um, I hope that your days are filled with sunshine and that life is good. And remember, folks, we are perfectly imperfect. You are loved, wanted, and needed far, far more than you will ever know. And I will see you next time. Bye for now, everyone. Thank you so much for watching.